Uh, what do we have here? Google hints at solving unwanted calls by injecting more AI into call screen. A feature to better handle unwanted calls could be on the way later this year. Well, call screen already kind of works and is good. Uh, the project manager said Google is looking to solve the problem of unwanted calls. The solution could be AI, robocalls to spam. Unwanted calls are scourged to plagues most phone owners. Absolutely, this is completely true. I notice a lot of spam I get is from phone numbers that are close to my phone number. Okay, yeah. Like maybe it has something to do with the way it's like the same these area attacks code. work. It's a very it'll just be close to my phone number and be a scam. It's weird. Mm. Uh, as discovered by Nine to Five Google Group Product Manager Jonathan Eccles uh, on the latest episode of Made by Google podcast, the future where you should never ever ever be annoyed at the thought of your phone ringing. It should always be a moment where you assume it's something important or something delightful. Man, companies, tech companies love the word delight, delight. and delightful. It's yeah. nutty. Nothing should ever bother you. And at the same time, you should never, ever feel like you're ineffective or unproductive on any phone call. Shout out. Individu- individuous. Individuous. Uh, I agree with that. I mean, otherwise people, they put it down for good. They're just like, I'm done. I don't pick up the phone anymore. Mm-hmm. I'm sick of it. You get a couple of spams in a row, a couple of duct cleanings. And you're out. A couple of FedEx deliveries that aren't actually yours, you're out. Multi-step, multi-turn, conversational AI could open a lot of interesting doors in terms of creating this protective and helpful layer at the front of every incoming call. AI, basically you get a call screener, like a full-on seeming like a human, uh-huh. so they can know for sure, hey, that was spam. Yeah, and right now there's like um, prompts where you can kind of select. Yeah. But imagine AI that could just talk to you, talk for you and then relay the info. Or you can just read the transcript. Which kind of phone does the Dalai Lama use? Um, I would say an Android phone. Like an old one. Or maybe a Nokia or something. The 3310. I don't know. <laughs> does that mean anything? Yeah, He's a bad guy? I just asked you, man. I don't know curious apple's interested they want to know 